हेलो हेलो दिस इज नेक्स्ट क्लास व्हिच इज रिलेटेड टू काउंटर टाइप एडीसी इन द लास्ट क्लास वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट फ्लैश टाइप एनालॉग टू डिजिटल कन्वर्टर व्हिच वाज द फास्टेस्ट वन नो वी आर टॉकिंग ऑफ काउंटर टाइप एडीसी व्हिच इज वेरी इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड सो लेट अस स्टार्ट दिस दिस इज द ब्लॉक डायग्राम ऑफ काउंटर टाइप एडीसी Uh, it makes use of binary up counter it is not a down counter this is up counter this counting from 000 to 001 and so on so this is uh, n bit counter it can count to any length then this is digital to analog converter this digital to analog converter is using this equation that is y not analog output is equal to b2 to raised to power 2 plus b1 to raised to power 1 plus b not to raised to power 0 where b2 is msb and v0 is lsb uh, this equation can go on to length till n minus 1 number of bits we have truncated truncated it to 3 bit sequence only and this is a comparator circuit that we are using here comparator circuit job is to compare the two input signals vd and va this is the analog input signal which is applied as input to the analog to digital converter and this is a and gate so clock given to the binary counter is ended is gated clock basically so this is and gate uh, this is comparator this is digital to analog converter and this is binary up counter this is a reset pin so whenever reset pin is applied output of the binary counter go to 0 0 0 let us understand the functionality of this this is output this is counter output is basically output of analog to digital converter and input to digital to analog converter is this analog input and output is this now counter is initialized to zero with reset pin we initiate with this that counter is initialized to zero with reset pin so whenever reset is applied counter output will be 0 0 in this example to understand it better we are taking up an example that this binary counter is a 3 bit counter so output is 0 0 because this output is 0 0 0 so dac output will be put b2 b1 b0 0 0 0 so yo will be equal to 0 we are taking into consideration that k proportionality constant is equal to 1 and hence yo will be equal to 0 so this yo in this case is vd vd is equal to 0 now which input is more analog input or vd input in this example we have taken analog e input equal to 6.5 volt so 6.5 volt is more than that of this and this comparator is working as a comparator of these two signals so whenever output is positive we consider it as binary 1 whenever output is negative we take it as binary 0 that is output of the comparator so in this case when we compare 6.5 volt with 0 volt here output will be 1 the output is 1 clock is applied so vo is 1 clock pulse positive clock edge is applied Be because of this positive clock edge clock will go to the because of this clock edge will be reaching here because of this 1 binary counter will start counting up so previous state was 0 0 now new state is 0 0 1 now this output is 0 0 1 now 0 0 1 value to be put here 0 0 1 so output will be 2 raised to power 0 which is 1 volt so 1 volt will be coming here and here we have already 6.5 volt so which one is more 6.5 volt or 1 volt 6.5 volt and output will be because positive terminal input is high in comparison to negative terminal input so this indicate that output will be binary 1 so still output is binary 1 output is binary 1 next clock is come from this side and it will reach here so output is binary 1 uh, i mean vo is binary 1 this is binary 1 and vd was 1 volt and next clock is come because of the next clock output of the binary counter will go from 001 to 010 so now new output is 010 so 
0 1 0 now deck output will be 0 1 0 will be 2 volt now 2 volt will be vd so 2 volt is vd va is 6.5 volt if we compare both of them still vo is binary 1 and hence vo is binary 1 as long as vo is staying binary 1 counter will get the next clock and it will move from 0 1 0 to 0 1 1 so next is 0 1 1 if we put here 0 1 1 then this will be 2 plus 2 raised to power 0 that will be 3 so output will be getting is 3 volt now 3 volt is more or 6.5 volt is more 6.5 so still vo you are getting as binary 1 so still it is binary 1 and hence this will reach to the next clock of the binary counter so <coughs> here point to note is a point will come when you will get 1 1 1 in the output here let us say I'm, I have got uh, 1 1 0 in the output 1 1 0 in the output so 1 1 0 means 1 1 0 2 raised to power 2 is 4 plus 2 6 so 6 volt is the output 6.5 is smaller so still binary 1 here so this will get the next clock so 6 volt binary 1 here next clock will be coming that is 7th clock and this 7th clock will cause the output to go to 1 1 1 this is 7 volt now this is 7 volt and this is 6.4 which one is more 7 volt or 6.5 now this 7 volt is more and this is leading to 0 in the output now this will become output 0 if this is 0 clock into 0 will be 0 here so next clock will not be going to the counter and counter will stay at its previous state which is 1 1 1 right so output will be 1 1 1 now its decimal equivalent or in terms of voltage if you calculate it will come out to be 1 1 1 is coming out to be 7 volt but input is 6.5 volt so here we are getting a conversion error of 0.5 volt but what is the maximum error that we can get during conversion so maximum error should be if it is 6.05 we might get 111 in the output so this can be lsb plus minus lsb so maximum error can be plus minus least significant bit it cannot be more than that so this is the uh, how much error that we can get next is how much conversion time takes place in converting this analog input into binary output so it is in terms of clocks first clock coming then second coming then third coming so in this case when we have taken a 3 bit counter and 3 bit can counter can count maximum up to from 0 to 7 so we have taken up a data of 6.5 volt so this 6.5 volt data he is able to count in how many cycles 7 clock cycles 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 clock cycles 7 means 2 raised to power 3 minus 1 which is 7 so generalized expression will be conversion time will be 2 raised to power n minus 1 clock cycles are required to convert an analog signal into digital signal so 2 raised to power n minus 1 so we also say that this is the this is very slow, uh, slow analog to digital converter. Thank you very much.